Hello YouTube! My name's Crosby. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Happy to have you here. If you don't know already, or if you haven't watched my last video, I'm going to Thailand for an entire month. I am going to show you how to pack for an entire month and what you should bring and what you should avoid and all of that. So come pack with me! <music> Last year, Whit and I went on a month-long honeymoon, so I have some experience with going on month-long trips. So let's get started. <laughs> let's pack. Um, first and foremost, I always start with like, like essentials, I guess you would say. I am personally going to bring nine pairs of underwear um, just because we have washing machines and stuff, so we're able to wash. And since we're going for an entire month, I don't need to bring like 30 pairs of underwear. That would be such a waste of space in my suitcase. Socks, I'm bringing seven pairs. Um, oh wait, I just found two more pairs of socks. We're gonna wash everything. So I'll wear my socks and then I'll just wash them. Easy peasy. feel like I'm gonna be wearing Converse mostly in Bangkok and Chiang Mai because we're gonna be doing a lot more like walking around. But once we get to Phuket, I need to buy myself a pair of sandals or flip flops or something. <laughs> so I guess I'm bringing like Nine, nine pairs of underwear, nine pairs of socks is what I'm bringing. I'm also bringing a few nice sets that, so I can take OnlyFans content while I'm there. Four nice sets so I have underwear to take content, or I guess five actually. I Side note, I will not be able to access my OnlyFans while I'm over there because it's illegal over there. So if you are subscribed, um, I will not be able to message you back for the whole month. However, um, I will be scheduling my regular weekend PPVs every single weekend. So I will be sending out messages, but I will not be able to respond to messages. So I'm just letting you know that now. But yeah, if you're not subscribed and you'd like to, link in bio. And then bathing suit wise, I was gonna bring four bathing suits. I've got this brand new one, so I definitely wanna bring that. And this one, cause it's so cute and sparkly. And I feel know I love a high-waisted one piece. So this is like pink super hot looks stunning on me and then i'm just gonna bring a basic white bikini but honestly i'm probably gonna do so much shopping and hopefully find like some cool bathing suits there god my hair looks so bad okay so i got my hair dyed but i didn't get to cut it because i had coupons and you can't use coupons in the same day so i'm getting my hair cut tomorrow so like the dye job looks so cute but i hate the way it's cut okay it's fine it's fine it's fine, it's fine. i have six t-shirts that i'm gonna bring honestly my plan is to pack one side of my suitcase and leave another side completely empty so that I can like put all of the stuff I buy in that side that I feel like I just don't really need to bring that much or if I don't feel like I have enough then I can just buy it because everything is so cheap there so I definitely want to bring the shirt it comes with a matching skirt my only problem with the matching skirt is that it's kind of big like it's not as flattering as I would personally like it to be that's my maybe pile back there. <laughs> I'm gonna bring this dress from my God Save Queens try on haul because it just like, I feel like in Bangkok at night, like on like a deck somewhere, I just feel like it'd be such a fucking vibe. So, and then I'm also gonna bring this dress from my Solstice Intimates try on haul. Just like total Thailand vibes and I can just imagine me like taking like a gorgeous photo in it. So I'm definitely bringing this. Yes, I feel like you can't go wrong with just like a little white crop top. I feel like a cute little crop top that I always definitely bringing these. I had these on the honeymoon last year and a blue bodysuit. It just, I think I have like 10 white shirts. So all the white shirts are gonna go in maybe and then we'll decide. I have this suitcase that I brought from Oregon of just like clothes that I thought would be good. This shirt, I think it's so cute. I also need to show you guys, I have not showed anyone this. Y'all are going to literally die. Okay. It was gifted this from a company called Thrifts and Threads. It is just like the coolest outfit I've probably owned in like a long time. I got these pants. Look how sick these are. Wait, look at these freaking pants and they're ombre pink. I literally can't wait. Hold the photos. Are you kidding me? I asked it. For them, from them specifically for Thailand, like I was like, hey, I'm going to Thailand, like, can I please wear one of your outfits? Okay, but this is a top that you tie together, and this is one of the sleeves. You like put it on like this, and then it like ties. There's like a tie in the front and a tie in the back. Okay, so I was planning on bringing this. The temples they need to be respectful and cover like 
your shoulders and knees basically so I thought like a long white skirt would be nice for so I have this cute shirt it's like it like it has like zippers to go to LA like get off the plane looking like a baddie I don't know and it has matching shorts like a uh, biker shorts so I was gonna wear that with some converse okay I know I'm for sure gonna bring this dress I actually wore this on my birthday last year and it's just like it looks stunning it's backless and it has pretty sleeves and I'm just obsessed with it I got on my honeymoon last year like <laughs> if you I'll probably bring it I'm probably gonna bring these because they're just like really comfortable for like walking around and stuff on white pants and they're just like so flowy I feel like they'd be perfect at the beach like why wouldn't I wear them I'm gonna bring them this is literally just like a long brown tube top dress and I just feel like it would be really comfortable this is like a good like beach cover-up and honestly I could probably wear it to the temples like I could wear a tank top to the temples and then put this on when we're actually like walking through them is what I might do I don't know I don't know definitely want to bring this though I feel like this is just like this oversized shirt with some matching pants but I also have these two flare leggings that I'm obsessed with I'm gonna use these to travel in for like the 12 hour and six hour flight I'll probably end up wearing a pair of these because they're just so comfortable like I'm planning on going on like a massive shopping spree and hopefully that'll be like a video that I make for y'all oh I'm also gonna bring this because it makes my boobs look amazing basically <laughs> and then this is the bag that I carry around um it's like a cross bag you know like whenever you travel internationally you should always carry a cross bag so that you can have all of your belongings on the front of you. Pickpockets are a thing literally everywhere. Every country you go, there's always gonna be someone who is an asshole. My husband just brought me lunch, so I'm gonna go eat and then I'll come back and show you what like makeup and everything I'm bringing. Okay, I'm going to pack my makeup now. Also, it has been like five hours since my last clip when I said that I was gonna eat lunch. <laughs> so, I'm back. This is the bag I use. I got it from Target. First and foremost, I have my all my primers because it's supposed to be really humid and I need my makeup to stay on if I'm wearing it. Obviously, I'm bringing my contour and concealer and, oh, can't see anything. Concealer and foundation and blush, setting spray, highlighter. I haven't really been into like eyelashes lately, but I do have these little individuals that are pretty cute. So I'll bring them just in case. I'm gonna bring this. This is like a hair wax stick and it's you with like baby hairs and stuff. All my beauty blenders that I need. Setting powder, of course. Mascara, more brushes, eyebrow pencil, all the brushes that I need, mini scissors and tweezers, and a nail file. Cause you never know. I usually put my jewelry in these little packets because it's just easy to like keep them separate. Pretty much what I'm packing in my makeup bag. Okay, I'm done packing. As you can see, oh, over there. I'm only packing one side of my suitcase because I'm planning on buying so much stuff on there. Let's hope that it's worth it. I'm probably uploading this video the same day that we're leaving for Thailand, so so excited to share this with you guys. Okay. <laughs> Bye.